Thank you for buying Red Sea's Magnesium Pro Test Kit. The purpose of this video is to demonstrate how the test is performed. Before using the test for the first time, make sure you carefully read the instructions in the manual provided with the kit. The kit also comes with a complete quick guide showing the stages of the test in simple graphic instructions. We start the test by taking a 2 ml sample of the water. Try and be as accurate as possible with the 2 ml. We then take reagent A of the test and we're going to put in five drops but we're going to put them in one at a time and we're going to shake for approximately 15 seconds between each drop. It's important to make sure that each drop is a full drop. One. And we shake for 15 seconds. Two, three, four, Another one. Now drop number two. And again we count 15 seconds. Drop number three. Again we shake for 15 seconds. Drop number four. And drop number five. And one more time, shaking for 15 seconds. We're now going to add reagent B. We have to add five drops and they go in one after each other. One, two, three, four, five. And we now shake for a few seconds just to make sure it's properly mixed. And we now leave this on one side and we wait for 60 seconds. In the meantime, we're gonna get our titrator ready and we draw exactly one ml of titrant into the syringe, wait for the liquid to rise up in the syringe and set the quantity with the bottom of the plunger at the 1 ml mark. This is now ready to use. We place it into the center of the titrator making sure that the scale is visible and now we just wait the last few seconds until we complete our 60 seconds. Okay, that is our 60 seconds. The reaction is now ready. We screw it onto the bottom of the titrator and we start doing our titration. To begin with, we can add about the first 0.4 of an ml very quickly. And thereafter, we slow down. We are looking for the blue end color. And you'll see there's a series of purple colors that are indicating the end of the titration. We're still in the red, so we're not even close. Okay. We're getting closer as the purpley color is beginning to form. Okay. Almost there. And one more drop and we'll have our blue color. And there we go, this is the end point. Now this is the blue color you're looking for, but it's very quickly going to go back to a purple color. Ignore the purple color. The first time you saw the blue is the end point of the reaction. Now we look at our syringe and we see that we used up 0 0.072 of the titrant. 0 0.072 we look on our table, 
0.072 gives us a magnesium level of 1440 ppm of magnesium and that is the end of the magnesium test.